it's always, especially in the creative world, I'm sure like in the beginning when you started, people were like, what are you doing? You know, like I said, even in, oh, yeah. in the beginning, some of my better friends weren't listening. Some of my best friends now just came around and would listen to the first episode this year. So, and initially that affected me. Initially, I'm like, you know, come, like, how could you not support? But then came to the realization of like, nobody owes me shit. So there's a million podcasts out there, you know? At the same time, when I'm listening to music, I'm not always listening to my friends' music. I'm listening to Drake, Kanye West, whatever the case is, you know? So it's like, at that same aspect, they can listen to Joe Rogan. It is what it is. But the fact that they're coming back around now gives me a little bit of acknowledgement. Like, I must be doing the right thing because I call your attention without telling you. Here's what it was. I'm not going to listen to shit that you don't believe you're capable of doing yet. That's people do not... There's a reason why people don't get hired at interviews. It's because they don't believe what they're telling the person that's interviewing them. Mm. In the infancy of being a podcaster or interviewer or trying to get along in this business, you don't believe in yourself because you look like, you know, we look like a pig staring at a wristwatch when you open up all the fucking different things that are out there that you have to get done as a podcaster. Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah, and exactly. so we don't believe in ourselves and we are seeking other people to love right. us in that moment, right. support us, exactly. and give us support me what so we're I can not. believe. Right. 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 But that isn't how that it is works. That is a great point. I'll that believe in you point. when you believe in yourself. That is okay. what that means.